Right, back again. As Martin would say, 20 minutes later. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's all saddled up, all ready to uh, rock and roll. I've got this uh, guy doing a strange walk right in front of the runway. Um, I'm not bothered, no, because uh, you're not supposed to be up here for commercial purposes. Uh, right. Nope. It's uh, rough as old Harry ground up here today. Uh, see how long that grass is? Really, really long. So I had this problem the other day. Uh, I've got one of the other ones up here. No, it's not going to like it. I can see me doing this. There's a hand launcher. Get it down. So. <clears throat> That's better. It's not bad. Not. It's how heavy. Bad. That beep you hear every now and then is a is a countdown on the uh, on the uh, TX. Uh, beeps every minute, um, so unless you've got a five minute timer. Um, quite pleased with a hand launch. Didn't think it would uh, take off on this grass, even though I've converted it to a tower dragger. The, uh, Proof of the pudding will be in the landing um, because the uh, the normal um, tricycle landing gear on this will be ripped straight off on the, on the first landing. It's a shame. Um, unfortunately, all. Of Apart from sort of tundras and things like that, they seem to um, do test flights on nice hard standing runways um, and not in the real world fields, you know, where you know sort of you haven't got a perfect uh, runway. 
to land on. But no, I'm, I'm quite pleased with this so far. It's, uh, it's behaving itself quite nicely. So want to do a... Uh, yeah. Yeah, nice and quiet. It's behaving just how a high wing should behave. Um, there again, no mixing uh, on uh, elevators, rudders, throttle, etc. I just like to do it just by stick. And that's uh, it's, uh, safe, obviously, on takeoff. No bother with landings. Um, but takeoff, absolutely. As I was saying to uh, Ian the other day. And I think Martin uh, agrees somewhat with my philosophy. Let's open the taps up. That's not bad. I say it's never going to set the world alight. It's only um, seven nine volt two two C uh, two S, but no, I'm I'm happy with that. Um, it's about three quarter throttle, which which I'm uh, quite happy with. The guy got a bit nervous then when I went uh, close to his quad. Right, right, let's uh, let's bring her in. It was always going to be, it was always going to nose over, you know, because the ground up here is as rough as old Harry, as they say. Uh, but no, it's, um, it's all there. The, um, yep, yeah, it's still fine. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's good. Nice and solid. Yeah, no damage to the prop. Rear wheel, bang on. Yeah, quite pleased with that. Um, inauguration flight of the Tower Dragon 850 Ranger. Uh, note that I've had to put the counterbalance weights on there um, to offset that because that is quite heavy, especially with the um, glue, the hot glue, and that um, carbon fibre square tube at the back. Adds a fair bit of weight right back there. You've got to counteract it with uh, a couple of five gram weights at the front, but hey, I'm okay with that. that that's good. Yeah, that's absolutely fine. As I say, it was a little bit towel heavy, but um, it might be because of the battery I was using. Uh, so I've got some lighter weight batteries, uh, some heavier weight batteries, I should say. Um, right, so without further ado, let's turn this off and uh, have another flight.